dear learner our continuous journey to solve the IAS spectra problem which reached to the second problem and today we will see from the given data how to solve the IR spectra from that a small small molecule we can do if a larger molecule is there we required a NMR and mass data let us go here these are the spectral data is given to us so molecular formula is given to us these are the characteristic signal in a IR so this for the characteristic signal to us so if we see here then uh, degree of unsaturations or we can say du is equal to 2c plus 2 minus h minus x plus n divided by 2. So, according to this equation there are two uh, four carbons. So, this is two carbon 2 into 4 plus 2 minus 8 x is not here nitrogen is also not there divided by 2. So, we cancel out this and what we get 2 divided by 2. So, A is equal to 1. If the du is 1, there are a different different possibilities. I can say what are the possibilities in this case. So, the structure could be like this CH3, CH2, C double bond O, CH3. One of the structure is like this. Another structure CH2, double bond CH, then CH2, CH2 OH. Another possibility CH3, CH2, CH2, then COH. Another possibility is I have this is the possibility one du containing this compound can be possible then these are the available of uh, possibilities of a compound now we will see one by one what is the problem with the structure one so this is a 22980 if the signal 2980 is given 1490 is given so, 2980 is a characteristic signal of carbon sp3 and a uh, hydrogen. For 1490, that is characteristic signal with carbon with a heteroatom. Carbon with a heteroatom. So, it could be a carbon with oxygen, carbon with nitrogen, carbon with the sulfur, or, or suppose. 1500 centimeter less it could be a, this possibility based on a molecular formula we have only this possibility so one is very clear this is not possible because if the carbonyl is there the characteristic signal is about 17 double centimeter inverse it is not here so this structure is not possible oh that characteristic signal is about a 3500 centimeter inverse but it is also not there so this structure is not possible this also have a characteristic signal at about this one uh, 1700 centimeter but that also not there so I can say this is also not possible now this is the possibility of the structure because this is a sp3 carbon and hydrogen and this is carbon and oxygen but we have the confusion what about this 930 and 830. So, when there is a 930 and 830, I can say if I have a oxy structure, this is an oxy ran structure, oxy ran, or I can say epoxy. This is a three member ring. This is three member ring and three member ring is uh, not stable due to that it break not stable 
is not stable due to angle strain. So, we are getting two characteristic signal at about uh, 930 and 830. So, 930 centimeter inverse and 830 centimeter inverse. These are the characteristic signal for this one. So, now what is my structure? My structure is CH3, CH, CH2, CH2, O and this one. So, this is the possibility. If I can say, uh, this is a three member ring. If I, a total, there is a four carbon. And 1, 3 is a uh, possibilities of the structure. So, this is the, this could be a possible structure for my case of uh, uh, given spectroscopical uh, data, right. So, this is the possible structure and uh, to get a such type of explanations of IR spectra, you can continue with this learning process then you can update if you subscribe this channel thank you thanks a lot